Hey everyone, this is Angela, one with gray hair at Silver Linings, and in today's video, I'm going to be talking with you about a product that was sent to me for review called Wavy Talk. It's a flat iron. I'm going to tell you all about it right here, right now, on Silver Linings. Okay, the first thing that I want to tell you is that this is not a sponsored video, but they did send this product to me free of charge for my honest review, and that's what I'm going to give you. I have tried it once already, so I am familiar with it. I do like it, although full disclosure, I honestly do not use flat irons a lot. I have one specific use that I use a flat iron for, and I'll tell you that in a few minutes. So here's the box. I absolutely love the packaging. I love it. I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's one of those magnetic boxes and you see there it says V7 Twist of Magic. Now it does come to you in this very very nice velveteen pouch. So as you pull it out, of course it's got the big wire attached to it nice long wire which I appreciate okay and then it does have a lock on it if there and if I pull down on it it will open and if I push up on it at that same spot it will close so safety wise that's very good of course it's not plugged in yet and again it has this really nice wire nice and long I'm going to plug it in. Okay, so it's plugged in. As soon as you plug it in, you're going to see Can you see it heating up there? It heats up pretty quickly. Let's just wait and see how long it takes. This is just seconds, everybody. It's 273, 282. 293, 298, 307, 311, 316. Okay, we are now at 350. Right now it's off. If I want to turn it on, I'll turn it to the right. And there it goes. Heating right up. It gets very, very hot. Do not leave this lying around where there are children. I'm going to turn it to the left and turn it off while I tell you a little bit more about the product. And there it is off again. I love that feature. That's a good safety feature. Especially, we get busy, the phone rings, what are you going to do? You forgot the thing is on. First of all, we don't want to waste electricity. Second of all, we don't want to start a fire. And most importantly, we don't want anyone, including children who may be around, or pets, to get hurt. So now I'll just set this aside here and show you what else comes in this beautiful little box. I love these magnetic boxes. So now, I've taken out the pouch. I showed you that. The pouch that came with it. And now I'm going to put the appliance right on top of that pouch. So if you have a desktop or something that's a slippery top and you put it on top of that, that'll keep it from sliding. Okay, also included in the box, there are two clips, two hair clips, which is nice. Get your hair out of the way. You can never have too many of those clips. They're black. And I think I saw a pair of gloves. Yes. And there is your gloves. Okay. So we have the appliance. We have the clips. We've got the glove. We've got the pouch. So there should be four things inside of the box. Okay, so before I use any appliance, any blow dryer, any Dyson, anything, I straight out of the shower, um, I will of course have used a really nice conditioner, uh, and then while my hair is towel dried, I'll link um, I'll link a card for you up there so you can see a tutorial I did on hair, um, healing my damaged hair. So while my hair is still damp, I will put on about a dime sized of this lounge, just rub it all over my hands, work it into my hair while it's damp, and then I will use V7 
the Lanza Healing Oil. Again, about mm, a nickel to a dime size, depending, uh, all through my hair and scant on top of the scalp. You don't want to put too much on your scalp because that can definitely, too much product on the scalp on me, um, it, it doesn't help the look of my hair. Okay, so now my hair has been washed, conditioned, it's had the thickener put in it, and I put on the healing oil. And now I can use whatever appliance I want. So with the Wavy Talk, you're going to get less frizz and more luster, and it does really complete your styling in half the time as long as you follow the instructions. Always read the instructions. It will go from 170 up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. For my type of hair, I use it at 350 degrees. It does have multiple heat settings, um, so you can go with, with uh, pretty much any, any length that you have. And you'll see in a moment it has a round edge, it has 3D floating plates, and it really does glide through your hair smoothly. And really does make it silky and shiny. My hair is pretty silky and shiny already. That's just the normal texture I have for my hair, but it will tend to frizz if I don't put some kind of a protectant on it. And as I've said, I use the Lanza Healing Oil to get that beautiful silky texture and abundant shine. And lastly, I want to tell you that you can use them worldwide. They have voltage compatible with 100 to 240 volts. As I said, it has a safety lock for storage, has a very generous swivel cord for flexibility, and 60-minute auto shutoff function. For those of us who forget that our appliances are on, yours truly, <laughs> I love that. Okay, so now let's get into it. I'm going to turn it on. Oh, and I did want to tell you the reason I mentioned at the beginning of the video that I would tell you why I use a flat iron. It's pretty much the only thing that I would use the flat iron for. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen with you again. And um, one of the most annoying things to, for me about my hair is I have a part uh, in the back of my head, I'm not going to show it to you now for the sake of time, but if I don't address it, my hair will literally, literally split in the back of my head, whether it's freshly washed, whether especially after I've slept on it. Um, you know when you're in line behind people and you see their hair is all flat and you know it, it you, you could see like bald spots where their cowlick is? Well, that's what we're going to talk about. That's what got me interested in flat irons to begin with. So oddly enough, I was about to buy one, and then this one came to me in the mail for reviews. Um, okay, so here we have, you can see, she's got this part. That's exactly what happens with me. And as you go through this video, she shows you how to get rid of that part, that very unattractive part. And it doesn't really seem to matter if you've got thick hair, thin hair. It happens to an awful lot of people. So what she does is... She, I'll show you, fixing the split right here. Right on here that you just sprayed because that's just gonna completely fry it. Once the hairspray is dry, I'm gonna go in with a flat iron. So my hair is curly, so I don't wanna flat iron the whole thing, but I'm just gonna grab it from the side like this. I'm gonna go an inch or two up and do that one more time. So I'm just going to leave my hair like this until it cools. You know when you curl your hair and you have to hold the curl until it's cool so that it actually stays in your hair? Okay, so then she's just telling you basically that when it's cooled, she's going to back comb it. And she did put a little bit of spray. I passed over that part. She did spray it a little bit um, before she started, to, uh, before she hit it with the, uh, with the flat iron. And then she back combs it and then she smooths it out. But I will link her video below so that she can, you can see the whole process. It's only a four-minute video. But this was what prompted me to want to find um, a flat iron just for that reason. Now, let me see if she, she turns. Yes, she does do a spin for us so we can see the back. In that position. And once you're done, that split in the back of your head should be completely covered. Okay, and again, she did use um, hairspray at the very beginning when she pulled her hair up from that split area, a firm hold hairspray. 
Okay, so again, that link will be down below for you. Okay, so right now you can see it is in the off position. I am going to turn it to the right, and as I keep turning it, if I go all the way to the maximum, you can see it will go up to 450. I don't want it that high. I already know from experience. I will bring it down to 3... 350 I think and then uh, to unlock it again it's not hot right here so you if you're nervous about that you can always use the glove I'm not nervous about it but if I was I would use the glove and now you're just gonna pull down you'll hear that and to lock it push it back up okay so I'm gonna unlock it and there's the plates three hundred and fifty degrees All right so it is three hundred and fifty degrees and now I will show you just by taking the end of my hair my hair is pretty straight it doesn't have any curl in it. it has a tiny little bit of a bend in it because I I curled it yesterday high heat white hair will turn your hair yellow always use a product to protect your hair. All right, so here we go. Now, I'm not straightening per se, but I'm just going to give it a bend at the end. You could see how fast that happened. Look. So if you've got something that you want, if you want more of a curl or if you want more of a wave, now I will tell you that while you're working with it I would put the glove on because it does start to get a little hot and I'm going to put the glove on my left hand while I do the left side of my head so I'm only using that right now especially when I want to lock it because it is a little warm alright so then to lock it just push up and you see there and remember 60 minutes and it's gonna auto shut off so Keep it someplace safe, but if you forget, in 60 minutes it will turn off. So it's off. Take my glove off. And then I'll comb this, this piece out. If you've got really curly hair or, you know, you've got a, a, a big bend in your hair and you want to get rid of that bend, this is going to work very, very quickly. Use a small piece of your hair first. Try it. Maybe take a piece of your hair and uh, take the clip that they've provided. Safety first, always, always safety first. I'm going to grab one of those clips that they've provided. I would say just get your hair up and then maybe take a piece of your underneath your hair and try it there and see how you like it. Always test, test, or, test. So yes, I would recommend the Wavy Talk V7, especially if you have thick, wavy or even curly hair that you want titanium plates to straighten it out. Again, the caveat, just be always be very careful with any heat that you put on your hair. Always make sure that you use a heat protectant. I hope that helps. If you use the Wavy Talk and you like the Wavy Talk or you don't like the Wavy Talk, we would love to know your thoughts in the comments below. Well, thanks so much for watching everyone and a special thanks to Yola at Amazon for sending me along the Wavy Talk V7 for review. I want to remind everyone to, especially at the holiday season, look for the silver linings. They're still everywhere. This would make a beautiful gift for the holidays and any time thereafter. See you next time, everybody. Bye-bye.